doing here? Oh, we're going to troubleshoot our circuit board. We're having uh -huh. a little bit of trouble with it, so we're going to see what we can do. Is that a tester right there? Yeah, this is it. Actually, is this that, is that your tester board. unit? Yep. This okay. Is it. Okay. So let's see. We're going to see what we've got right here. Whoa. All right. Hey, it? That's good. Okay. That's good. Uh, and this one. Yeah. yeah um, that one doesn't work too well. Yeah, well, I think you see. might need help with that one now. Let's see. Oh. Um, how about this? Yeah. Oh, oh that, that worked. worked. That worked. Yeah. Oh, there's one. Oh, we got a fire over here. Making it through the traces right there. Nice circuit board. Yeah. You want to grab a, a fresh circuit board? Uh, could you go ahead and uh, is that is that the uh, static clamp so no static gets on it? Yeah, that's the okay. anti-static clamp. You want to make sure you always put that there. Yeah. Because if you don't, then you'll mess up the whole board. Yeah, I know what you mean. Okay. Okay. So, so what are we gonna test first? Well, first what about off, those two big ones right there? Sure, we'll test those. Okay. Let's check let's those see, out. We're supposed to get like really big sparks over here from right here. So uh huh. Let's see if actually... Oh, you're right. You're right. actually definitely right. I, I think that's working pretty good. Um, could you? Oh yeah, that's working. Okay, yeah. Oh, I heard that one. Yeah, that one looks pretty good. Uh, yeah, that one's good too. Okay. Uh, yeah, that looks pretty good. You mind if I give it a try? Go for yeah, it. Here, here, here. I think what we're gonna do is just try to give uh, the LEDs a test. Uh, maybe uh, do a bypass on the uh, on the uh, 555 timer. Okay. All right. So okay, there's the lights on. The, there's the lights. Okay. Oh, yeah, that light on. There, that light on, see? See? Okay. Got it. So these are all testing positive, but of course, when you hook it right there, things fly out of the plate. I don't know why it does that, but okay, let's let's try this one over here. Woo! That one did it. Okay, yeah. <coughs> okay, let's see here. We're getting good action out of these things here. I mean, uh, good uh, testing. Yeah, that one works pretty good right there. Now, if we just hold it there for about 20 seconds, um, we should be able to get this rod straight through the chip. And, uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, it looks good. Uh, at about this point, what we're gonna have to do is just test this one over here now. Yeah, yeah, that one works pretty good too. See, we're getting into the silicon. We can actually diagnose the actual chip um, problem, okay? <laughs> It's like a birthday candles, you know? You try to put them out and they just kind of come back on. Happy birthday to me! <laughs> yeah, that's working pretty good too. Okay. Oh, that was pretty. Uh, happy Fourth of July. <laughs> Dude, somebody flew around the uh, room there. Uh, oh, that works good. That works really good. <laughs> Woo! Hello! Yeah, okay, well, that about uh, concludes our uh, testing uh, system. Uh, next time, we're going to do is uh, help Furby. We'll test that one out. Uh, thank you for coming. Have a great day on the rest of your evening.